Hi everyone, this is Brooke with Beyond Fabric, and I am here to show you how to put together the paper pattern for the dog bone stocking that we just did for Make It Mondays. So this is what you will print out. Um, there will be a link in the description box below where you can get this free template. There's also going to be a link right here to go to the video for the dog bone stocking if you have no idea what I'm talking about. They are free demos that we do with Beyond Fabric twice a month on Mondays. And this is our very first virtual one, the dog bone stocking. It was a lot of fun to make, nice and easy, and we show you quite a few little tips and tricks along the way. And so today, we're gonna put this together real quick so that you can get sewing. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm gonna take my scissors and I am just going to cut around the outline of each of these two pieces. So I'll have side A and side A <laughs> and side B, and then I will meet you back here in just a moment. Okay, so here we are with our two pieces of our pattern, side A and side B, and we are just going to match them up right there. There's no overlap or anything, and you'll need some tape. And just tape your pattern together. Now this pattern was made so that you can put this on the fold of your fabric and so then you'll be cutting out the full piece but if you don't want to do that you can always print a double of this and then you can just tape it right here so that you have the full one but I will go grab some fabric and I will show you how to fold the fabric and lay this down. All right, I'm back with my fabric. I picked one with a pattern on it so that you can see how I'm going to lay the stocking down on it. Um, if you've noticed, the materials needed are on your pattern. And so this would be considered the stocking fabric for the outside, two thirds of a yard. And so what I'm going to do is fold my fabric so that I have the fold at the top and I have the pattern facing me. So it's going the correct way. And then I'm going to place this with the cut one on fold right up there at the fold. And you really want to get it right on the fold. It's, it's not too big of a deal if you don't, it's just gonna make the dog bone stocking a little bit longer, but you really wanna get it right there on the fold. And so now that I have this here, I'm gonna go ahead and pin it and cut it out with scissors or you can use fabric weights and a rotary cutter however you want to do this but this is how you would lay it on your fabric especially if you have a directional fabric you want this looking up you want to see all of the text everything looks correct to you and then the fold is at the top okay if you have any questions or comments or perhaps suggestions for possible make it mondays you can leave them down below and remember there is a uh, link in the description box below on where to get this pattern and also don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the notifications bell so that you can know when we're doing new make it mondays get some free patterns and get some good sewing practice in all right happy sewing